Welcome back to season six of Body and Mind. The importance of a getaway from our day-to-day -day busy life is not one that can be ignored. We all need time to reset physically, mentally, and emotionally. And that's exactly what I'm looking forward to today at the Lighthouse Retreat in beautiful Ras al Khaimah. Everybody. Hi. Hello, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Simon. Good morning, Ash. How are you? Great. For, I already feel so zen and I've only just walked in. We haven't even gotten started yet. Oh, amazing. Well, thank you for joining us and welcome to the Lighthouse Retreat this morning. Oh, my pleasure. I didn't realize there's such a hidden little haven in the middle of Ras Al Khaimah. It's fascinating. How long has this been open for the Lighthouse Retreat? Uh, we opened in December last year. Um, Again, we're very lucky to be in this location right on the waterfront in nature, and especially in Ras Al Khaimah. We have the opportunities to be right next to the water, in the mountains, the greenery. So we have a little haven away from the hustle and bustle. So we're really yeah. glad to be yeah, here. Yeah, that's the word I was looking for, haven. Mm. Um, I think it's wonderful because uh, usually when we think of retreat, we often think of traveling outside of the UAE. So mm. I think it's a brilliant idea and concept for you to start right here in the UAE, in Ras Al Khaimah, which is mm. beautiful and easily accessible. All right, so I need you to tell me what I'm in for today because I'm okay. a bit of a restless soul, really impatient and impulsive. Right. So can, do you think you can calm me down today? Absolutely. So <laughs> we've got a number of activities today. Okay. Uh, the whole group will be taking part. Okay, so I've uh, had a quick look at the schedule mm. and it uh, turns out I'm here till dinner. So let's get started. <laughs> okay, great. So our first session today, we will be doing yoga and our stand-up paddle boards on the lagoon. So if everyone's ready, we'll uh, start that now. We have time to get changed and we'll get ready to go. I've spent about half day here at the Lighthouse Retreat and it has been quite the experience. I, do, I see the appeal now, Simon. I see what your clients uh, really come here for. Oh, fantastic. So talking about the experience, how do you feel everything has been so far? We've had uh, the early morning routine. We've had the stand-up paddleboard yoga. Yeah. We've had the breath work as well. And we've also had the art therapy with the team um, here. More than anything else, I mean, there's quite a sense of community because you're doing it with a group of people. So there's a lot of fun, laughter, like-minded people, most importantly. We started with the SAP yoga, which I thought was uh, quite uh, cool. It was mm. my uh, probably second time I've done uh, okay. anything that involves balancing on a paddle in the middle of the water. I was scared, I'm not going to lie, to begin okay. with. But it was actually very manageable, mm. very doable. And it was a great way to kickstart the day. And then, of course, we had the healthy vegan breakfast. Um, because usually my uh, breakfast plate looks like a zoo. <laughs> OK, right. <laughs> oh, it's all right. So, I mean, yeah, obviously, with the stand-up paddle boarding, we do yoga. Um, the reason we do the yoga on the board is that when the board moves, it obviously in yoga normally the floor stays still. But with the board moving, you get the interaction, the feedback from the board. So it's something called proprioception, where you get the neurofeedback between the brain and your muscles. So the, your, your body reacts, and in the reaction, you create more, um, more pathways, and then your body gets used to that in a, in a much quicker way as if the floor is stationary. So after SAP yoga and the healthy breakfast, of course, we had that little, what can I call it? Is it, is it a breathing routine? Is it a dance routine? What is it? <laughs> yeah, it's more about expression of yourself and acceptance all of part of yourself and all of the feelings. No matter like you are ashamed or you can't like have fears, like, you know, just to go through all of them and truly be open and honest with yourself and with everyone another. And as Mieva mentioned, um, the more you do this practice, the more you feel comfortable with it. It's like with everything in life. So after the breathing routine, we had a little painting session. It, it just took me back to my school days when we had our little art and craft class. What is, why did you have that? So we, we all creators, we all have this capacity to create. And when we are kids, we do it naturally. And we don't have this 
oh, I didn't do it good enough. You know, I assumed it would just be one of those sessions where you paint on a canvas and then, you know, someone's going to tell you, uh, you know, you are this sort of a person <laughs> or this, these are your goals in life. <laughs> but the twist to this whole experience was when you had us rotate, mm. move and work on each other's paintings, because I just started working on this beautiful flower and suddenly you were like, OK, move, move. I'm like, what? No, this is my painting. <laughs> why, why did you do that? Exactly. This is how about life. We think, okay, I'm going to live my life, I don't know, eight years or, or something. And now I'll do this and then I will do that and then I will do that. And then I should kind of perform in a way. But life doesn't work that way sometimes, you know, and it changes and it sometimes also works with our attachment. So it's to bring that aspect, just be in the moment and enjoy that. It's also a great way to remove your fear of starting over because you look at this canvas which is already halfway done and you almost have to start over when you don't really know how to or where to but you still manage to get into the flow of it strangely. Simon, I know that it's only been half day. What's next for me? <laughs> so we've got lunch. Okay, yes. And then at three o'clock, we have our fire and ice session. Okay. Uh, and then after that, we have Reiki, followed by dinner. And then this evening, we have full moon uh, yoga mandala with Eva again. Let's get on with it then. Brilliant. All right. Enjoy. <laughs>